Hi there, Pokemon fans. Real life Pokemon attacks here. So every month I get in a lot of mail. Tons of these coming from card market, eBay, um, you name it. And it's full of Pokemon cards. And today I would like to show you what exactly it is I have been getting in this month. So the first card I would like to show you and be it the price of probably all what came in this month is uh, the Reverse Expedition Charizard. I bought this for I think 15 euros. I say euros because I'm in Europe, not in America. Don't exactly know what the dollars would be. 2018, something like that. It's gorgeous, love it. It's a bit, bit damaged here. It's the plate one. That's why I paid only 15 euros for it. But I think definitely worth it and a great investment because this card is probably only going to increase in value the coming years. Next is Anamparos, Amparos, also Expedition, a holographic. Lovely art on that, also a played one. That's why I only paid two euros for it, which is basically a steal. Butterfree, also played. You can see the crease here, which is unfortunate, but nah, what are you gonna do? Because it also was two euros. I try to find as many uh, cheap cards because I have a limited budget, around 100 euros per month. So that's why I try to find as much cards that are like um, 2 euros, 10 euros, at most 20 euros. And I don't really mind that they're played, you know, it's not a PSA 9 or 10. It's never going to be that because for that you pay like 100 dollars, um, triple that, quadruple that. But uh, just to have the card played for 2 euros? Nah, it's definitely worth it. Also, I could probably instantly sell this on like eBay for 20 euros. So the investment, always great. Next one is Wildbloom. Also for 2 euros. Because it's played. Mostly on the back. Front is great. Just lovely. Bought a cloister too. Just look at that art. There's like a, a wall here in the background, I think. Also Expedition. And on the Expedition cards, I, I really love the um, like lines they have right here. It's both on the reverse cards as the holographics. It's like the holographic area is behind the card as well. It's really nice and lighting like I've put up here. And then Gengar, paid a bit more for this one. I think I paid like four euros for it, but yeah, it's a Gengar. What you gonna do, right? <laughs> Such an awesome card, much better than uh, most other Pokemons, because it's so cool. Look at that evil smile. It's like, yeah, I'm going to murder you all. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> something like that. Chaos move, hide in the shadows, yeah. Also played, you can see it. The top is damaged, which is Sad, but yeah, for the price, you know, just to have this, I think it's gorgeous. Probably planning to like buy one PSI 9, PSI 10 in the future, but at this point, it would cost like 300, 400 dollars. And nah. to be honest, I'd rather have like 10 of these for like 4 to 10 euros in a binder than like one PSI 10, because just having like nine next to each other of the same card, that's like, that's really epic. Also, this month bought Dugdeo. I bought all these um, Expedition Holos with uh, the sa same seller on Card Market. Um, got them all for like two, three euros per piece. So, saw we had that and I well, instantly went for it, of course. Great price, great value, all played. 
there's many on card market eBay plate they go for little because everybody wants the PSA 9, PSA 10 but you know you've got to appreciate the little things uh, damaged here but well the art it's all about the art I think as long as the holographic even with few scratches is fine still appreciate the card like look at this Dragonite that's just that's insane. <laughs> I love Dragonite. Everybody is a fan of Charizard and of course I am too. You know it's a Charizard, but one of my definite all-time favorite Pokemon is Dragonite. Really underrated. It's a really cool dragon. And the art on this is, is like it's incredible. Also I paid for this one I think around 3-4 euros also with the same card market seller. It's a great card. Really lovely. It's a bit damaged here. It's a crack here, but you know, it's an expedition holographics and like the set is really rare. Uh, Wizards of the Coast era. Not a lot of these were printed, so even when it's damaged, I think for this value, and in the future I'm going to like sell it for ten times the value of the the three four euros I paid for it. So. Pharaoh is the next one. Really cool art on this one. Not really a fan of Pharaoh. Nobody probably is because it's like, yeah. But the art on this, the waves, the gorgeous dust or, or clouds. He's treading with his with his wings. Oh, that's, that's very cool. Another one that came in this month and got in a lot this month. I think we're like halfway there right now. Clefable, look at that. Look at that. So moonlight and clearly there's moonlight here. It's like jumping over I think a city or like a village in the moonlight. That, that's why I love Wizard of the Coast era. The art was so much better. Doesn't need to be like a whole cover of GX or V Max or anything like that. Just simple, a little area here. Awesome art. Cool Pokemon pose. Yeah, very nice. Love it. Next up, we got in a Feraligator. Which is really strange because this art it's almost like for alligator is a small pokemon which clearly is it's not the length is seven on seven so rather big pokemon swimming in a swamp also expedition hollow and also paid for uh, this i think around two three euros next we have pichu completely different seller Condition is a lot better. This one is uh, always, almost near, near mint. I wanted to get this in a, a much better condition because I love... Of, of all the, the expedition hollows, I think I love this art the most. It's gorgeous. Pichu is like really happy jumping on a, a cloud or in a, in a field of, of flowers. The flowers are being thrown around. Look at that. I think I paid uh, 10 euros for this one. Great card. Just just awesome card. And we have another Duck Trio. Why do we have another Duck, duck Trio? Wait, we did have another Duck Trio, right? <laughs> yes, we have a second Duck Trio. <laughs> Simply because it was also was um, two euros and it was with one of the other sellers. I think it was the, the Pichu seller. And I paid 10 for the Pichu and two for the Ductrio. And I was like, why not get the Ductrio the second time? You know, for that value. It's an awesome card. Staying in the earth. The earth is being broken. Awesome. Just, just so cool. Next up, we have some other cards that were the holographics. 
for Expedition. What else I bought this month? Let me put this a bit better, because I want to be safe with my cars as much as possible. A Skarmory. Also Expedition. A Reverse Holo. I think I paid 5 euros for this. Sorry about that. <laughs> the data memory on my cell phone was full. So let's continue where we left off. I apologize if you see a time skip suddenly. <laughs> Stuff happens. So we were talking about uh, the Skarmory, uh, which I bought for, I think, uh, 5 euros. Um, great card. It's a reverse, also Expedition. Would be lovely to have the whole set reverse and um, holo graphic, mm, which is called, I think, a master set. Would be very cool. Then we have uh, a Flareon from Sky Ridge. No reverse on this one because the reverse is so expensive. Um, I think it's already 30 or 50 euros. Um, but I bought this. Um, Excellent, good. Um, almost near mint, I think, for two euros. So couldn't pass that up. It's a great card, lovely, and also a rare. If you see uh, the packs um, right now, are going for um, almost a thousand um, euros. So just to have that a rare that could be in one of those thousand euros packs for like two euros. Um, Bought this on eBay. No, that's that's great. Another one from uh, Skyridge, and a great investment. Also, also came in uh, my uh, mail postage this month. Is a uh, a Moltres. Just look at that. That's great. The art on that. It's flying uh, over, I think, uh, if you can see it here, um, a building or like a, a mountain where a road is paved into. A real sky ridge. Also paid, um, I think, um, two euros for that. Hound Doom. That's... Awesome card. Would love to have this one home graphic, but Skyridge is, yeah, has become so expensive. Um, I'm happy to just get uh, the normal rare cards for the price. I think I paid uh, four euros for this, five, which is also great. Great card, great price, rather cheap investment. Next we have that here to see how far we are we're almost there halfway there <laughs> mach cargo also two euros and also a rare another mach cargo bring it to this one that's both the mach cargos of the the scavage set very cool And that's it for the Wizard of the Coast era. The rest is um, stuff that isn't expensive. As oh, sorry for the language and the tongue fall. Uh, the rest isn't uh, expensive at all. But uh, these are great cards. I ordered this the moment it came out. I paid 20 cents for it. Reverse. Holographic Darkness Blaze Pikachu. Look at that. It's forming like this ball of lightning around him. And like the reverse is very cool with the, with all the lightning that's there. Just great. And for 20 cents, you know. I think about uh, three of these. Because in a binder, which is um, three rows of three, it's very nice to have like three on a row and for 20 cents with like 
one euro of shipment. Can't pass that up. Another great card I bought, which just came out, also Darkness of Blaze, is Sukune. Look at that. The Aurora holographic on this card is awesome. Also paid like 20 or 40 cents for it. Instantly bought three, because it's like such a cool card. And like 20 or 40 cents for a holographic is ridiculous. You know, modern cards go for, when it's a holographic, for like 10 cents, 20 cents. It's like insane, because a pack is six euros. And all right, holographics are a lot easier to pull than GX or V or, or, or Secrets or, or, or such, but just looking at this and then comparing it to like Expedition or Skyridge, I think it's like right up there. And right now it's 20 cents, but take like two, three, four years, this card is going to go like for 10 euros, 20 euros, and that's an increase of. of, of, of 100% so so buy 10 of these uh, for 10 euros and you're changing it to a value of 100 euros So get this card get the Kunis, get Pikachu's And also get Umbreon's This is from uh, Undaunted It's a secret rare It was the only one left on a card market and I paid 20 euros for it. On eBay it's selling PSI, PSI 10 for like um, 200, 300. And it's just an awesome card. And once I got this, instantly wanted the other one too. <laughs> Which is of course Espeon. Also from uh, Undaunted, Secret Rare. Paid 6 euros for this. But um, it's a bit damaged here. But still, I think there's a few left on a card market for like uh, 10 euros, but uh, to get you hurry up, get those, because the value of this card is just going to increase, PSA 10 is already selling for, for 500 euros, so 6 euros for this, even when it's a bit damaged, um, be making it excellent. Can't pass that up. Great investment. And talking about evolutions, evolutions, um, cosmic cosmic eclipse Vaporeon has like the most gorgeous art ever. Okay, maybe not ever. There's a lot of gorgeous art, but just just look at that art. That is like so cute. Look at that. It's rolling around. So about three of those. It's reverse, paid um, also 20 cents for it, something like that. Everything Vaporeon and Umbreon always goes insanely up in value. I think in a few years this will be a $20 card. So 20 cents right now, go for it. Eevee, same story there, 20 cents. Cards that uh, increase in value 100 times. Also Cosmic, cosmic Eclipse. Pikachu's. Cosmic Eclipse. Wow, it's a hard word for me. Cosmic Eclipse. <laughs> Reverse. The lightning here is very cool. And like Pikachu is doing like this insanely cool move. You can just see the action there. This is like also uh, common, they all are, but the art on that is insane and it's 20 cents, I also bought three of those. And then I bought Gengar, which also has this like Aurora holographic vibe from uh, Darkness of Blaze. Gengars usually are more expensive than other cards, so, so these already goes for one euro. Also bought three of these. Insanely cool card. And then, just for nostalgia, we bought <laughs> Jesse and James. 
which are such a cool duo from uh, Hidden Fates, holographic, also for like 20 cents. And that just gives to show what you can buy for only 20 cents, uh, 40 cents, doesn't have to be uh, cards of 100 euros, of course that's always cool, everybody wants the new Charizard GX Secret Rare, oh, 500 euro old bottles, give it to me, uh, but nah, just give me the cheap cards with the cool art, 20 cents, and I'm a happy person. This card is, I think, the most gorgeous Rayquaza ever in the trading card game. It's a promo from Sword and Shield, and the art on that is gorgeous. Look at that. It's flying through the sky. You can see the earth there. This is probably one of my favorite cards from everything that arrived this month. Just gorgeous. Look at that. Almost there. The last three cards. This one. I had to get. <laughs> Why? Well, paid 15 dollars, euros, sorry, for it. Or, yeah, dollars. Almost the same thing. And just love the art on that. The Mega Sublime is eating um, gems. And Tyranitar is holding the cave wall from collapsing because uh, Sublime is uh, eating so many gems that the cave is caving in. It's just awesome. And I wanted to get this a bit more expensive. Not a few cents. But. Uh, it's a great addition. The value of this, will it increase? It's the Renatar, so probably will, but not like the other card, probably. If it goes for 30 euros in about a few years, that might be it. But for 15 euros, just the art, have this in your collection, very nice, lovely. Then we have the Handoom V. Which is from Sword and Shield, probably the nicest or one of the nicest cards that came out so far. Look at that, so cool. The fire here, the eye that glints. You can get this for 5 euros, which is a cheap price, great value. It's on Doom, so might increase a little, but it's a normal V, so probably not so much. But also one I just had to get because of the cool art. And that's it for what came in this month. I started with the Charizard, and I'll end it with the Charizard too. Didn't really get this one in the mail. Got this in the Champions Pack, Champions Path. Uh, elite trainer box I opened in the previous video, but look at that, so great, gorgeous. These are going for 30 euros, but probably will go hundreds of euros once the first uh, graded PSA start appearing on eBay. So yeah, suggest you get one and get one fast, because it will go double, triple the price in like a year. And that's it. Thank you very much for uh, looking at my video, showing what uh, I got um, this month. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, like the video if uh, you liked it. Uh, leave a comment, tell me what you think, even tell me what you got in. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.